Hello everyone, here in this video, I'm going to show you that how you can make these thumbnail images circular. So basically, this is the border radius of these images. So I will show you step by step that how you can add this same feature into your store by just copy and pasting the code. So basically, this is quite helpful for you. So let me show you how I did this. So firstly, you should refresh this page and you can see that this is the default behavior that is in square, but I am interested to make them circular. So firstly, you should go to the dashboard of the store and here you can see that i have installed down theme if you have any other theme then still this feature will work so click on these three dots and duplicate this theme because later on if you have any problem or something so you can actually roll it back to its original version once you duplicate it then you can click on edit code and here you will see that we have certain uh, folders and files so um, we need to find css file actually so you should search here css in this case we have base.css but if you have any other css file for example theme.css style.css or maybe main.css so you should open that css file and scroll to the bottom and then uh, here we will be adding a small code so let me show you Firstly, you should go here and you can actually right click on it, click on inspect and then scroll a little bit down and here you can see that this is a button. So basically this button name is uh, thumbnail, but we can also put this tag thumb uh, button uh, and the parent element is this one. So which is thumbnail list item. So I'm going to add this class name here. You should put dot and then paste the uh, name of that uh, class here and then you can write here button element and then after you should uh, add curly braces and right here you should write uh, border radius 50% and add the semicolon and then you can actually save the changes once the changes are saved then you can actually refresh this page and let's see now here you can see that all the images are now circular. All right, so that's how you can actually make them circular. One more feature I have already created. So let me show you uh, what exactly that is. So you should uh, go back. So let me see, uh, let me preview this. And here we, here we have certain uh, images. And you can see that I have added these uh, thumbnails in the left sidebar. So uh, in the left side, you can add it right here. Right now we have in the bottom. So in the next video, I will show you that how you can add these circular or maybe uh, square thumbnail images in the left side. Okay. So in the next video, you should uh, actually watch this and you can just copy and paste the things and that's it. So one more additional thing I wanted to add here is for say example, you are interested to put these things in uh, desktop view and in mobile view, you want something different. So let me explain you what exactly I mean. So for example, this is the mobile view. You can see it look like, the, like this. So for say example, you want to uh, keep these uh, circular images as square, but in desktop view, you wanted to make them uh, circular. So how we can do that? So let me show you those cases. So for example, you are interested to uh, make uh, square images, thumbnail images in the uh, mobile view. So how you can do that? You should add media query at the rate media only screen and max width 749 pixel and here you need to write curly brace and you can actually copy and paste this here but you can actually write here border radius zero and then click on save so let's see how it works. So once changes are saved, then you can preview the changes. Go back to uh, this. For example, I was testing this product. So right here, you can see on the desktop view, these are circular, but in mobile view, it looks uh, square. So that's how you can actually add uh, the condition on the basis of screen. But in some cases, for example, you want to make them circular in uh, mobile view, but in the desktop view, you wanted to make them uh, square. So how you can do that? You should go back to the code again. So you should write here that uh, you should remove this and you can write here 
uh, max width 749 and right uh, here 50 percent so that means maximum width is 749 and minimum can be anything so uh, smaller in smaller devices the border radius will be 50 percent so let's save the changes and now you can see that in desktop view if i'm refreshing it will remain the square images but in mobile view you will see that these are circular so this is how you can actually uh, implement this same feature into your store by different conditions by different uh, screen sizes so if you have any problem or something or if you have a new feature to develop then definitely you can ask me i will help you out in solving that problem so you can uh, uh, find the contact details below in the description so if you're new on this channel then please subscribe this channel also like this video you can follow me on facebook instagram and tiktok and you can also join a whatsapp group which i have recently created so i keep publishing latest content content on that so you can be in touch with me so uh, if you are facing any Shopify issues so you can uh, ask me I will help you in solving that thank you so much once again see you in the next video